All right, this is how I sync audio to video in Final Cut Pro 10. You'll see I already have four events created here. One is called Clips. That's where I keep all of the clips that have not been processed yet. The other one I have is the other event is called Audio Files. That is where I keep all of the audio files that haven't been synced to those clips yet. The other one is called Middle Sync. And that's where I'm going to be. This is the event I'm going to be actually using to process these clips. Um, and then the other one is synced videos where I have the audio already synced to the video. So we're going to get started by heading up to clips and we're going to look at our first dialogue here. It's called audio control buddy. And uh, we're going to drag. Whoops. Let me, let me select the whole clip and we're going to drag that to middle sync. So it's going to remove it from the clips library and add it to the middle sync uh, event, not library event. Then we're going to go to audio files and up to where it says audio control buddy. We're going to select all that and we're going to drive that, drag that to middle sync. Now I'm going to click on middle sync. You see we have these two files here and uh, you'll see at the beginning. So to simply do an audio control. That's one and. So to simply do an audio control. And you can see the quality you know, camera versus microphone is way, way different. So we're going to highlight both of these and I'm going to right click. Then I'm going to click synchronize clips and I'm going to call that audio control buddy. Whoops. Um, sync. And then the event I want to put that in is not middle sync. I want to put that into the synced videos so I don't have to manually move it and then go ahead and click on OK. Now it's gonna automatically sync the audio to the video so that you don't have to manually do it. So now let's let's hop into, now it's gonna, it's gonna take us automatically to the synced videos event. We're gonna hop in here and let's select the clip that we just synchronized. And we're gonna click on, we're gonna right click on it and click open clip. Now we have it right here and we can trim off this audio that's obviously not part of it. And audio control, you can name your unit. And then I usually just drop the audio down there. You can name your unit whatever you would like. This specific unit. So now we have the the audio automatically synchronized between the two here. And that's it. It's done. So you can just trim it a little bit do you think so I'm gonna I'm gonna bring that all the way to the beginning of the clip there and so to simply do an audio control you can name your unit beautiful in it his name is buddy so if I like you just X test command. it so this allows you to still it's awesome so very very good now um, what you want to do is go back to middle sync and you can highlight both of those delete so you can reject them we have it set for hide rejected and start on your next clip 